The whole situation in Sunik and Gerarkunik provinces is fully controlled by the Armenian Armed Forces. The Ministry of Defense stated that the situation hasn't changed. The American side considers the actions of the Azerbaijani forces inside the border of Armenia unacceptable and provocative. Jake Sullivan, national security advisor to the U.S. president, stated in a telephone conversation with Armenia's acting prime minister, Nikol Pashinyan. The domes of the church were removed under the pretext of restoration without the participation of a spiritual community. The U.S. Commission on International Religious Freedom has expressed concern over the condition of St. Hazan Chetot's church. Armenia submits interstate application against Turkey with the European Court of Human Rights. An Australian politician calls on the government to recognize the genocides of Armenians, Greeks and Assyrians. And Armenia's corona statistics for today. 212 new cases confirmed, 323 recovered and 13 deaths.